What is up, my angelic beings? It is I, Angelic, and we're back. We're back with another video. Finally, we got our first ever gameplay trailer for Monster Hunter Wilds, and I am here to do my first ever breakdown on any video game trailer ever. So, I hope you guys enjoy, and I'm sorry for the quality. It, I would like to be able to do something about that in the future, but I would like to also thank Kogoth on Twitter for allowing me to screenshot his page and use those screenshots in this video. I reached out to him, very nice guy, the Monster Hunter informant, and um, yeah, let's just get straight to the to the breakdown. So the trailer starts at a sand sea. We have a sand ship, and then we see our hunter and our palico, both which are fully voiced. Then we see our blacksmith, our smithy, we, her name is Gemma, and then we see our handler, that is Alma. Then we pan over to a, a strange boy, and we don't know anything about him yet other than he may be important, or that necklace. His name is Nata. Or Nada, uh, probably Nata. And then we see something. We see like a peak of probably a large monster. Uh, then we see large monsters everywhere. We see the ecosystem. We see a flying wyvern. And then we see ourselves riding our secrets. Then we see a brand new type of herbivore called the Serotonoth. Then we see a little baby Pookie Pookie there. We see another new herbivore, a Deltadon. We see some. Uh, raptors, and then we see our very first large monster, Doshiguma. So this game will have herds, so there's going to be multiple large monsters in a herd. So if you've played Monster Hunter World, you're going to see we have the Hook Slinger back, but it's more of an upgraded version, right? So right now in the trailer, they're driving away the leader of the Doshiguma horde, and then we see a sandstorm, we see the weather effects kicking, we see the horde of those shagoons we see a very weird large monster there probably might be a probably another herbivore large monster and we got our first ever hunt we got the great sword we got the monsters attacked we got some new attacks he hit us we got the superman dive back and then we see another new monster called chatacabra a new amphibian type monster this monster seems to have adhesive uh like saliva because you see his rock the rocks like stick to his arm after he licks them and then we see that our secret actually can like help us when we're like knocked down then we see the environment interacting with the large monster we see the little like apex not apex like the little raptors attack the, the monsters then we see we get on a secret and then we have mounted attacks we also have two weapons here we have the brand new like gimmick of this game called focus mode and that gives you access to your ultimate hunting actions. You see, every weapon has its own, like, focus mode attack or attacks, it seems. And all 14 weapons are back. Here we see a little bit of cutscene. Our hunter being tasked with researching this new area. Here we see the SOS flare for the first time. We see a multiplayer. We see four hunters right here. We see one with a longsword, a hammer, and then a gun lance, not a gun lance, a bow gun. And then we see like some sort of parry effect. Maybe a lot of masking for us. This could probably be like a universal thing. And then we see the trailer ends right there with Wishlist Now 2025. And then we get some bonuses if you have played Monster Hunter World or Iceborne. So, I... This is a lot. So, obviously we started a sand ship in the sand sea. And what they cut to... Like, right before this, like, little snippet ends. So, back in the old games, back in Monster Hunter 4 and, like, I think 2, I'm not sure, there used to be these giant, like, sand whale monsters called the Morons. Uh, back in Monster Hunter 4 Ultimate, this game uh, seems to be, like, taking a bit of an inspiration of... They started the game in the exact same way and then we got attacked by one of those large Dare Moran monsters and that's how our journey started. Here it looks like maybe there's gonna be the same thing so maybe the Morans are back. Here we see how the like weather changes the ecosystem and we see how cutscenes are now seamless again like back in Monster World. If you played Rise you know that we had like a cutscene before the hunt and then we would go hunt um, it looks like 
uh, it looks like when you attract the horde, if you go like far enough, they might like stop aggroing you. And then obviously we have the sandstorm, and then the monsters are getting like dug in the pit. That seems. I am still not sure if that's a large monster that is like hostile. And then this seems to be the very first hunt that we go in, right? Either that or they're giving us like a mid tier monster. But Doshaguma seems to be a very low tier monster. So is Chatacabra. Uh, Chatacabra seems to be like take some inspiration from uh, Garen Golem from Back in Rise and also a bit of an inspiration from uh, Devil Joe. Uh, and obviously here we have like the Wirefall esque like recovery from Monster Hunter Rise. But you know, a bit more like balanced, I guess. And we can ride the monster. Uh, we can ride our secret, even while the weapon is sheathed. I wonder the secret is probably also gonna like show up in multiplayer hunts. Uh, it looks like we have a parry there. I wonder if that's like specific to focus mode, or I wonder if it's like also a universal thing. Probably not. Um, we got. A familiar looking dude, honestly. He looks like the Ace uh, Lancer from Monster Hunter 4. And in the at the end of the trailer, you know, we see all the we see little, like new armor sets, and then we see to the right we see a long sword user, and then to the left we see the other two hunters, one with a uh, gun lance, not a gun lance, fuck. It's a bow gun. I think it's a large bow gun, a heavy bow gun, and then you know. That's how the trailer ends, and well, that's all we were given so far, but we're, we'll be given more on the 7th of this month. On Summer Game Fest, they already announced that there's going to be a brand new trailer, and they're going to show off a new monster, which I'm expecting it to be the new like flagship of the, of the game, the flagship monster being the monster that's in the cover of the game, and... Uh, that's really all I've been able to find in this trailer. The, you've probably seen other people already break this down. And <clears throat> if you even, like, came across my page and you have a look, I, would, I, I am appreciative of that. So, um, this was my first ever breakdown. Uh, there's really a lot that we could still find in this trailer. And there's a lot we could find in the other trailer. So... I'll definitely be back for that a new trailer, and I'll definitely try my best to, once again, break it down to the best of my ability. Uh, thank you for watching, and <laughs> when the game comes out, happy hunting. We'll be back with more trailers, and I will just do my best, alright? Thank you for watching. And once again, thank you, Kogoth, for allowing me to use these screenshots. <sighs> This was a lot harder than I supposed. I expected it to be, but we got it done. So uh, that's an achievement for me.